This is Jeff Podlasik with Toad DB2 Development. I'm going to demonstrate some features that we've added to our Toad DB2 version 5.0 release. I've got Toad up and running now, and I've got a couple of database browsers open. The first one's connected to a DB2 ZOS subsystem. I've got the Tables tab open. And what I'm going to do now is select multiple tables, right click, and select Utilities, Truncate Tables. So in this new 5.0 release, we now allow you to very quickly and very easily generate truncate tables command. And of course, just like our other utility and command generation screens, you can very quickly and very easily specify the options you want to use, select show script, and generate and execute the truncate table commands. And the same holds true for DB2 LUW. This database browser is connected to a DB2 LUW database. I'm on the Tables tab. I'm going to right click, select multiple tables, right click, and say Utilities, Truncate Tables. And again, this brings up the Truncate Tables command. You can very easily generate the Truncate Table statements for LUW. Another thing we've changed for DB2 LUW is on the Utilities Set Integrity screen. The screen existed in our previous release, but now we've added a new command option. This command option is called single commands. If you leave it false and generate the script, it's going to generate uh, one set integrity command for all the tables that you selected. If you wanted to change that to true, then we will go back to the old-fashioned way of generating individual set integrity statements for each table. 